because it's good. By Toyota. I love what you do for me, Toyota. By Edie's Grand Ice Cream. Evidently, it's not your normal ice cream. And by Kentucky Farm Bureau Insurance. All-around coverage, all-around Kentucky. Wildcats pulled away in the extra period. Antoine Walker with 31 points and 12 rebounds in that game. We'll talk a little bit more about it as we go along. But right now, let's go courtside with Doug Bruce and the Shoe Carnival starting... Kentucky's lead here at halftime to 16. We've reached the break. Good to have you with us at Rupp Arena. Our halftime score, Kentucky 51, Kajiva Marese 35. ...comes in to help point students in the right academic direction. Carl Nathy has more in tonight's University Report. But Seconds left to go. First half here at Rupp Arena. Rob Bromley along with Martin Newton and Dick Gabriel. And it's been all. and Marshall in freedom. <laughs> that was great. He came diving into press row and got the thing caught around his ankle. All right, a timeout on the floor with 7.53 left first half. Kentucky. Eight to 31. We'll be back to Rupp Arena in a moment. Love the stuff we're made of by Kentucky Utilities. The power to live more comfortably by the Kentucky AIDS Hotline. Answers for all of Kentucky 24 hours a day, toll free. And by State Farm Insurance and the State Farm agents throughout Kentucky who support Wildcat basketball. Thanks very much, Rob. Some good news for Kentucky football fans. Bill Curry and CC. 90 to 60 is the final. And to wrap it up, let's go to Dick Gabriel. Dick. has been their team defense just absolutely television station again kentucky this year has led the conference in all sec academic performers obviously something kentucky will be just as proud of well antoine walker now in the wildcat band finishing up as the two teams head back out on the court. This ball getting it out ahead of the defense, and that got this crowd going. And boy, once Kentucky gets on a run, watch out. I'll tell you, here tonight, Martin, Rupp Arena really is alive, I think, as it has been all season long. This, this crowd into this game. Yeah, really, it's the first time in the second half that <laughs> Kentucky hadn't been ...group who feels that because of their depth... Nine, eight minutes remaining in the first half of play. Always look up ahead. Yeah, abysmal from out there this year, but they really have to work hard to set themselves free for a basket. Well, what Nolan Richards impersonation <laughs> screen? There's just nobody to pass. And they've already got five turnovers. They're only averaging about 14 as a on the UK Basketball Television Network. That's one for the fun. Well, it's hard to believe in a way, Martin, that it... Half a 
basketball in Rupp Arena this season as the Wildcats go for that undefeated record in the Southeastern Conference. Time for the freshmen. Throughout the remainder of the season, all the way through the SEC and the NCAA tournament. It's been a lot of fun. It's been a lot of fun to be with you. Well, I will echo those sentiments. It's been a lot of fun. You guys are great to work with. And uh, it's not, I told my wife, it's not often you can get on TV and make an idiot of yourself. And I've had fun. <laughs> family of companies urging you to get involved when parents help just imagine how much more a child can learn by the united states postal service we deliver for you by flavor rich freshness from our family to yours by bank one whatever it takes by pernell's old folks whole hog country the ncaa tournament championship and he is the clear favorite going into march madness They'll speculate undoubtedly about the upcoming NCAA mm -hmm. tournament. First half, Mississippi State lead by five. Pat O'Brien will be along from New York with Penzoil at the half after this message and a word from your local station. Great. I mean, Rick Pitino said all the right things yesterday. The players said all the right things yesterday, but they did not expect to be in a one. All right, Mike Gorman, Troy Man, just uh, simply had the wind knocked out of him. He's going to be just fine. He'll get back in. Question is, how much of a difference is he going to make with this blitzkrieg going on right now? Kentucky's fine so far, too. 19-11, they lead this one by 8-12-17. It's a 19-14 game. Kentucky has a 5-4. 35-24 is our halftime. It's not a Virginia Tech's down nine. There's... Plenty of time in this basketball game for Virginia Tech to make a serious run. But they have to finish. There is really helped Kentucky. Is con Unlike when they played Wisconsin Green Bay, Virginia Tech's offense does not have as good a spacing in it as it did against Wisconsin. Take a look at what's going to be happening. Well, Kentucky is in control in Dallas, and Rick Majerus, Utah head coach, is along. Message and a word from your local station. That shot, the three-point shot, a big weapon for Wake Forest as it takes on Kentucky next. In Cincinnati with the winners in Lexington. Out in Denver, Syracuse beat Georgia in overtime. Kansas came from three down late to... set for Monday night to take on the winner of this battle. It should be Kentucky and UMass coming up when we return to the Meadowlands in New Jersey. Massachusetts is forward. Better, a 6'10 senior from Evansville, Indiana, number 40. Ties Kentucky's largest lead of the half. It's big time college basketball. See you later. Pennzoil at the half was sponsored by Pennzoil. For more engine miles, Pennzoil works like liquid ball bearings. Pat Quickness kills in Kentucky. When the curtain falls, a new national champion will be crowned, and you, my friend, have the orchestra seats front and center, right? Syracuse, 33. CBS Sports exclusive coverage of the NCAA. Kentucky goes on a 14-5 run, and now we're up by nine at halftime, 42 to 33 out here in the Meadowlands. And hi again, everybody. I we'll take a break and be back in a moment. Stay with us.